now Governor Pillen from Nebraska. Well, thank you. <clears throat> I want to say we got to use that word thank you a lot. Governor Abbott, courageous leadership. It's the words I think of when I think of you to step up. So thank you for all that you've done. Uh, I want to also say thank you to Governor Stiff, Governor Reynolds, Governor Noem for us being here together, showing great united and the other Republican governors. Uh, I don't think we ever say enough thank you to the men and women in uniform that are behind us. They got our backs 100% of the time, and uh, we never say it. And uh, I need to give a shout out to the uh, men and women from Nebraska. We've got 61 troops down. I got to spend time with at Alpha, and a couple got me behind the back, and General Strong. Uh, we had a great team. Couldn't be more proud. Uh, maybe one piece. One piece that I can bring. I'm the newest governor. I have the privilege to take the oath of office every January 5 this past year. That's very, very vivid in my mind. I took an off, I swore to the Constitution of the state of Nebraska and to the Constitution of the United States of America to defend, defend against all foreign and domestic foes, anybody that's trying to harm us. And I am here because we together have to work to uphold that. I like to use a one word. What's my one word of what I've experienced my first time here? My word is disbelief. Absolutely disbelief of the misrepresentation. That's just the misrepresentation of the buoys. I'm a pig, I'm, I'm a pig farmer. It's hogwash, pun intended hogwash. The buoys are a deterrent. They don't cause a band-aid, and if they do, I say, what the heck, stay on your side of the river. Uh, the misrepresentation of who's coming. I mean, we are fighting cartels that are trying to kill our kids. Kill our kids. That's one thing in the United States we all surely agree on, right? Is our kids? That we're going to protect our kids. So my message is simple. We have to do the work, and Biden administration, federal government, do your dadgum job. Common sense solve this problem. Follow the leadership of Governor Abbott. Thank you. Thank you, Governor.